the APS has been operating since 1996. It had a tremendous impact on science and technology. The advanced photon source work by using essentially electrons, accelerate these electrons very close to the speed of light, inject them in what we call a storage ring where they circulate. And as they circulate very close to the speed of light, they are gently wiggled back and forth in using arrays of magnets. And this actually generate X-ray light which is extremely focused light in the forward direction, which you can use for research on materials in general, whether it's chemistry, physics, biology, material science. And now we have faced grand challenges in science. We need to accelerate the pace of discovery. The APS upgrade is a project to open these new frontiers in X-ray science. It's a $815 million investment from the Department of Energy to modernize the synchrotrons, build a completely new storage ring. The electron beam that will circulate in the synchrotron will be much smaller in size. The angular spread of this beam will be reduced massively as well. And the combination of the size and the angular spread reduced by a factor 100 will give us light that will be much brighter than the current light in the existing machine. In April of 2023, the current facility will shut down. The removal of the existing storage ring will be underway, and then it will be followed by the installation of the new storage ring, which will last about seven months. In total, this will take one year. So in April 2024, our user community will be yet again able to access the facility to do research. So the long beamline building is a new part of the infrastructure of the advanced photon source. It's outside the footprint of the current facility. And it's there to host two new beamlines, the in-situ nanoprobe, and the high-energy X-ray microscopy beamlines. X-ray and synchrotron X-rays have been absolutely essential to understand how viruses interact with important proteins. The upgrade will actually accelerate this discovery further. We can look at a larger number of drug candidates that can actually target these viruses. And so this will be transformative in the sense that you can do what you were already doing, but at much larger scale. Once the APS upgrade project is delivered, the APS will be at the cutting edge of technology for X-ray science. This will really transform the way we utilize X-ray for research, and it will shape really our future as a nation discovering new materials that will actually impact everyone's life for decades to come.